I'm gonna go through three examples here on how to multiply two by two matrices. Right, this multiplication of matrices can get pretty confusing. Uh, so we wanna definitely start with the two by two case. Right, remember what two by two means? Those are the number of rows by the number of columns. So I like to always start my matrix arithmetic problems with writing down the dimension of each matrix. All right, this is going to come in handy when we have matrices that are not square. And I'll talk more about that in a subsequent video. But <clears throat> to multiply these matrices, a lot of people make a really simple mistake by just <clears throat> multiplying the corresponding entries. So negative six times negative two is positive 12. 1 times negative 5 is negative 5. Right? These, these are common mistakes. It's not this simple. That is not at all the answer. So don't do that. All right? It's not that easy. But it's also not that difficult. Right? Two by two matrices are fairly simple to multiply. When we get into the different kinds, the bigger kinds, it's a little bit more challenging, but here we go. <clears throat> so I'm going to erase all this extra stuff that is just in the way because this is kind of a, at first anyway, a visual nightmare. So I'm going to first start by trying to fill in this coordinate right here, this entry. Alright, to get that entry, what I'm going to do is multiply the I'm going to circle the first row and the first column so first row of the first matrix and the first column of the second matrix and I'm going to simply multiply negative six times negative two I'm going to add that to the product of negative 2 and negative 5. Now that's kind of strange, so we're going to do a ton of examples here in class and stuff. I'll do three on this video to start developing these patterns, and that's all this is about. It's just patterns, developing patterns, identifying things that occur every single time. So let's continue. We have the next entry. The next entry is going to be over here in our matrix. Let me close this off. I needed to make it a little bit bigger, but I think we're good now. The next entry is going to go in this position. So it's going to go row one, column two. So in order to get that entry, I'm going to circle first row and second column. Now I'm going to multiply negative six times positive one. And I'm going to add that to the product of negative two and negative five. And we'll come back and we'll simplify this all in a second. <clears throat> all right, next up, this entry down here. This is row two, column one. So over here, we're going to use row two, column one. And we're going to multiply one times negative two, add it to the product of two and negative five. Next, row two, column two, is going to come from second row and the second column. So 1 times 1 plus 2 times negative 5. <clears throat> and then we're ready to simplify. Negative 6 times negative 2 is positive 12 plus Negative 2 times negative 5 is positive 10. Over here, negative 6 plus positive 10. Down here, negative 2 minus 
10. Over here, 1 minus 10. Simplify. 22, 4, negative 12, negative 9. So the product of these two matrices is this 2 by 2 matrix. Okay. <clears throat> Number 2. And again, we're just going to learn by repetition here. I'll move this up a little bit. All right. So we have again the product of two two by two matrices. So here we go. We're going to go first column. Excuse me, that's a row. First row times first column. And we'll put that in this position. So it's 3 times negative 2 plus 1 times 0. 3 times negative 2 plus 1 times 0. <clears throat> Moving along, we've got, I'm not going to circle them anymore, see if we can get this down. Over here, and we're going to close out our brackets. Over here, we're going to go first row times the second column. So I've got neg I've got 3 times negative 5 plus 1 times negative 5. Down here we're in the second row first column. So I'm going to go 2 times negative 2 plus 1 times 0. Over here I'm in the second row second column so I'm going to go 2 times negative 5 plus 1 times negative 5. And I'm going to simplify. 3 times negative 2 is negative 6, plus 1. 2 times negative 2 is negative 4. Uh, that's not true. Plus 0. This one, of course, is a 0 as well. Sorry. Negative 15 minus 5 negative 10 minus 5 simplify one more time negative 6 negative 4 negative 20 negative 15 so the product of these two matrices is this matrix down here finally and we're going to go much faster for this one. First column, first row. So negative 6 times positive 2. Negative 5 times negative 4. Notice I'm kind of skipping a step here. Over here I'm going to go first row, second column. Negative 6 times negative 2. Plus negative 5 times positive 6. Second row, first column, I'm going negative 5 times positive 2. Second row, first column, negative 2 times negative 4. And finally, we're in the second column, excuse me, second row, second column, so I go negative 5 times negative 2, negative 2 times 6. Simplify 8 negative 2, negative 18, negative 2. The product of these two 2x2 two two matrices is this 2x2 two two matrix. Next up we're going to take a look at how to multiply uh, matrices that are not the same size. So we're going to look at how to multiply matrices that you know maybe have uh, bigger sizes or they're not squares, things like that. It gets a little bit more complicated than that.